So I'm thinking of starting a daily vlog just for a week though. Let me explain why. You see, we always over pressurize ourselves with goals that are not only hard but highly taxing and we end up giving it up. Went to the gym, lifted every damn weight possible and didn't see the face of the gym again in next a billion years. Yeah, we have all been there. In one of the Joe Rogan's podcast, Dr. Peterson talks about this, that we don't uh, aim low enough. Say you've got a kid and you want the kid to improve. You don't set them a bar that's so high that it's impossible for them to attain it. You take a look at the kid and you think, okay, this kid's got this range of skill. Here's a challenge we can throw at him or her that exceeds their current level of skill, but gives them a reasonable probability of success. So in the interest of keeping my goal as well as my motivation alive, I'm going to keep just, just one week as my first milestone. And we'll see how it goes from there on. And we can go back to the video. as you would have already seen. So he is getting a KTM Duke, Duke 390. 390. Yes. Yeah, it will be delivered on Wednesday, you said. that you would see in Bangalore, yeah, it's right. really, really difficult to ride okay. the bikes, man. Like it's so yeah. much air pollution and that's not something pleasurable at all. I mean, especially if you're going for a long ride, then it's good. And if I'm going for a long ride, I prefer going in the car sometimes because I have a lot of gear to carry. Done? Dates juice. By the way, Salman is also Prince of Advai. They studied in the same school. Yes. They have a lot of stories together. But not on the camera, right? Not for the camera. <laughs> I mean, the stories are very sensitive. You know, it's uh, you have to be sensitive taken. to Advai. Take care. I'll call you when they're delivering. Yeah, yeah, sure. Hey. I'm having some peanut butter and banana as well as some yogurt. I have a lot of these every single day. They're not only filling and healthy, they're also very tasty. My brother's office is quite far from here, so he has rented a house there. And I'll have to be sleeping quite early today. Given that I'll have to wake up early in the morning and I'll also be hitting the gym. And this, this will be sort of the first time in past like three, four years that I've been, I'll be hitting the gym in the morning. Not only that, I'll be shifting my food cycle as well. I've been doing intermittent fasting for quite like two years right now. 
and I'll be shifting that from 2 p.m. to 10 p.m. That will shift sort of in the morning so that uh, I don't starve after my gym. So let's see how it goes. This build a huge transformation that I'll be making. Hopefully it goes well, especially if I have to be having enough time to blog and do other stuff. It's important that I wake up early. So I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Three things you do here that make you a critic.